guys, Hobbybox604 here. I got a few emails and requests from you guys that you wanted to see my signed puck collection and my other stuff. So I decided to make a quick video and show you guys what I have. Start here with my pucks. As you can see, I'm a crazy puck collector. I, I love autographed pucks, especially the ones with the silver or gold ink. Uh, most of these I got myself. Some of them I bought. Uh, there is pucks from hockey players, football, soccer, baseball. Basically, if you're famous, I get you on a puck and put it in my collection. I have a few celebrities there. I have a few of the newscasts there. I have soccer players, BC Lions, and a whole bunch of random. There's a bunch of my extras down there. We go to the second shelf here. Some of my BC Lions, that's from the Great Cup that I got signed. That's uh, older BC Lion players. That's a signed mask uh, after the Grey Cup, uh, not mask, sorry, mini helmet. Uh, there is some of other stuff. There's an envelope signed by some of the hockey legends there. Uh, there's uh, Mr. Hockey. I got that from one of the shows. I met him. I got him to sign that magazine for me. Uh, that's a Ken Dryden autograph uh, card from the 70s. That's a wine signed by uh, these legends that I, you've probably seen the photos on my uh, Facebook. Uh, there's a bunch of random stuff there. This is a Lars Ulrich uh, Metallica drummer. Uh, it's a drumstick that he played, actually used that when they had the concert here in Vancouver. And one of the security guys got it for me and kept it for me this whole time and just gave it to me a few days ago. So I'm very happy about that. Uh, and that's all my random stuff. Hats there. As you can see, I also collect hats. I got a bunch of hats. Oh, more there. This is my Mika Zibanejad collection. Uh, he's one of the only guys in the NHL that is half Persian. So I collect him. There's a stack right there. Some of my Canucks cards there and some of the better cards here. Sorry, I, I uh, had a bunch of my good cards over here, but I took everything to the show uh, a few weeks ago and it's all messed up. This is my Frankie Corrado game you stick that I bought a few days ago from the store, from the Canucks store. Some of the uh, signed uh, pictures there. That's I got that myself along with that wine when they had the promotion signing uh, uh, at the liquor store here in Vancouver for Gordy Howe's birthday. Now we come to this side, my messy desk. As you can see, I work two jobs. I'm barely home, so when I open stuff, they usually get stacked here. And once a month, I go through them and organize everything. Uh, sorry about the mess. As you can see, there's a bunch of different stuff there. This is my rookie patch autos from the Cup and Dominion. That uh, is what I'm focusing on right now is this. I'm trying to sell all my regular cards and go with that. These are the ones that I got in the mail. I have to put them in one touch. There's uh, two rows of 70s and 80s cards. These are like absolutely in a, in a mint condition. I'm waiting. Hopefully grade them one day. That's another row right there. There's my Canucks cards and a bunch of random ones there. We go over here to the Wall of Fame. Uh, one of my, some of my favorite cards there. Spelled my name with different letter cards. Uh, we come here to the Luongo half of Luongo Shrine because the rest of the, the half, the other half is downstairs with seven signed Luongo jerseys and a stick and all that, which I might have in a separate video. That's his game use blocker from the 10-11 Stanley Cup run, signed by him. Which I don't know if I was a good idea doing that or not, but. That was that, signed pictures and all that. Then we come down here, we see that. E. Henri Richard, that's uh, Travis Lule, signed newspaper from the when they won the Grey Cup. I got Travis to sign that. I got Ted Lindsay, I met him at the show and got that. And then this one a few weeks ago, I went to the Lions game and I met some of the players to do that. Uh, that's, that's another one that I got after the Grey Cup. Oh, I forgot to show you this. I just got this a few weeks ago. Dale Weiss's game used socks. That's from last season. As you can see, there's a bunch of puck marks and, and blood on it. Uh, it was confirmed by Dale Weiss that was used. There is an, I, I realized that it was there was a small number 32 inside with a marker. So I asked Dale Weiss and he confirmed that was his. So yeah, that was awesome. I paid 15 bucks for it. Anyways, so this is it. This is Hobbybox 604 Room. I'm moving. I'll be making a man cave soon. And I tried to make this video under 5 minutes. I was successful. Thanks for following me. appreciate all your comments. If you have any questions, please ask. Thanks, guys, and see you next time.